morning. It is the opposite weather that we had yesterday. Like, it's so amazing that we had the weather that we did when we were going to see the Highlands. Yeah, when we were driving into the Highlands and going to um, ask you. Super thankful for that. Um, today it is rainy, just super rainy, cold. But you know, that's just Iceland. You just like always have to be prepared for whatever. Doesn't matter if it's summer. Today, our route is a little bit off the beaten path, you might say, and in the opposite direction of the Highlands. So we are traveling the northeast corner of Iceland, which is another place that we just have never taken the time to get to um, because we always just take the ring road and, you know. Today on the agenda is called Vapnafjörður, Arctic Henge, and the like. So we're kind of going up in that, um, that northeast corner. And then we're going to stay the night in Husavik. So kind of a lot of driving today, sightseeing stops along the way, and hopefully end with a nice sunny hot spring day in Husavik. All right, let's hit the road.
uh, just arrived in Husavik and had a delicious dinner at our favorite place called Gamle Boikers. It's where we first went to dinner when we were on our honeymoon, so we really love that place. Also, it is super delicious food. The scenery is great because it's right on the harbor. And did we sing the theme song for the Eurovision movie called Husavik as we were driving into Husavik? Yeah, of course we did. I'm a nerd like that, you guys. We gotta do it. Maybe we'll play Ya Ya Ding Dong on the way home. Just, you never know what's gonna happen. For those of you who have been following for a while, know that Husavik is where one of the stops that we made on our honeymoon, fell in love with Iceland and actually decided to move to Iceland in Husavik. So that's kind of a fun story. So we always love coming back here and somehow it's always really, really good to us. Um, the weather was absolute crap the whole drive from, we were like a little bit east of Miva area when we left. Just crap weather the whole time. Beautiful here, so we love it. Uh, and now we're going to a hot spring spa called GOC. This place has been on my bucket list since it opened, which was just recently within the last couple of years. So I am super excited to try it out. I have heard really good things. So let's go check it out.